so anyway, he, he, he shakes me up, and now I can't sleep. It's like 2.30 in the morning. He goes to sleep, and I can hear him, and he's snoring. <laughs> so then, so, so then, get this. So then I, I say, oh, my God, I have to go to the bathroom. So, you know, I'm, I'm tiptoeing in the dark, you know, with 12 people sleeping or 11 people sleeping now. I go to the bathroom, and on my way back into the room, I'm, you know, you know the door, I'm closing the door slightly, and then I grab my pants. I see my pants hanging, and I uh, on the uh, on the bed on the bunk bed. Yeah. And as and as I grab my pants to put it on the floor, uh, I realize that I have money in my pockets, coins, and they all fall out of my pocket onto the floor, and and it wakes up everybody. And they're all angry. They're very angry. Uh, that 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 was kind of uh, for me very funny. And then uh, the other experience was uh, with the uh, castle, uh, the uh, Ponferrada, oh, yeah, a, yeah. Beautiful, a beautiful Templar castle. And uh, you know, I, I, I studied the Templar knights, the, the uh, knights Templar, the Templarios, yeah. and uh, I, I love their story and what they did for the Camino and how they protected it, and um, you know all the things the Templars did. Um, I, I really uh, I loved learning about them. So, so just be, be, before you continue, I was there a few months ago. I I started there the Camino, the Camino de Invierno. Um, I started there, and because the there were some ease measures about the pandemic, and we are uh, some some pilgrims were able to do the Camino, and I chose the Camino de Invierno because it was not so so crowded. It's not, right. not too less known. It's less known than the, the others. And I started there. It's just an amazing place, uh, that, that castle. It's just amazing. It is. It, re really, it really is. Um, and I, I have a slideshow on my uh, website, uh, kennethstrange.com. I have a slideshow of our Camino with music. And I think you will like some of the uh, photos of the castle. Thank you. I definitely will see that. Yeah, it's 12, it's uh, only 12 minutes, so, uh, you know, it's not a long time, but I think you'll like it. So, um, the, you are telling us uh, the, that serious story. Well, well, no, the, you know, again, the serious story is, is I was talking about the Templar, the Knights, yeah. Templar. And so, um, when I came back, Uh, to the United States, I did a lot of research on the history of the Knights Templar, and I got to I got to really um, understand them uh, uh, deeper, more profoundly, and and I, I truly uh, am amazed at this order of knights uh, that protected that protected the Camino for you know almost two centuries, uh, you know protected the pilgrims from robbers, from assault, from uh, illegal uh, taxes. Or tolls, um, all, all of these things made me just. Uh, it brought me closer to the to the Knights uh, Templar. Yeah, amazing, amazing. Uh, we are almost finishing um, our our talk, but uh, I will just to, to ask you um, a last, last question. Uh, for for what what uh, would you tell to, to someone who never walked the, the Camino Santiago uh, I would tell them uh, do not be afraid um, you know that you can do it uh, because remember it's your Camino um, you know you know you you can do it any way you want and that's the that's the title of my book uh, because I was talking to a British uh, woman and she said you know The Camino is very, um, as, you know, it's it's um, it's an individual individual effort uh, to do it, and you can do it any way you want. You can take all the time in the world. You can take, you can even walk it, and then maybe you take a bus for a little bit or a taxi. It doesn't matter as as, as long as it's your Camino. Camino. So I would say, don't be afraid. Uh, try to, I would say, try to prepare a little bit for it. Uh, have very good shoes, very good socks. They're the most important parts, uh, as you know, uh, Guillaume. Yeah. You know this. Uh, 
so have good equipment uh, and uh, travel lightly. Uh, practice for maybe a month or two months, and and then don't go in there with any fixed thoughts. Just just let it happen. Let it come to you. Let it flow into you. And, go and go think, go with your mind open. Yeah, you go. That's exactly it. Exactly, exactly. So, uh, Kenneth, it was just an uh, amazing place to talk to you. Uh, thank you, thank you, thank you so much for 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 your time. Uh, and, thank you. And uh, I just wanted to let you know th that you have a friend in me. Uh, When you came to Portugal to know or to Spain for a, another Camino, please let me know. Um, uh, it will be a pleasure for me to to to, to meet you to meet you in person and to pay some beer or some wine. Um, and thank you, thank you so much for this. Muito, muito obrigado and uh, a pleasure. It's been a pleasure to be with you. We'll stay in touch.